Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be trying to film a studio vlog. So if you're new to my channel, start to subscribe if you're not new. Thank you for coming back. I didn't know when it was the right time to film because honestly, my business, it's been doing good, but I haven't really been selling that much, unfortunately. And I've been doing a lot of stuff like I've been promoting, I've been running ads. I ran, I'll show you. I ran one ad on, okay, the first ad I ran on Instagram. Okay. So these are all my accounts. It probably won't focus, but right here it says that I got one follow and a hundred more likes because i have an ad running so these are all the likes that i'm getting on my ad for my candles which is great but literally no one's buying so they're just liking the pictures and my ad it i had okay my instagram on my my instagram is a shop okay so right when you go on my instagram it has view shop and i'm gonna click it and then it'll take you to like all of my products see that's my coffee candle and then from here it says view on website and then here it is and then then you can buy it right here so it's literally that stuff and on my ad which is this one this is my ad it has currently 339 likes and I just started running it yesterday so I mean I think that's pretty good I don't know this is only my second time running an ad on Instagram but it has all of my popular candles on here it's reached 2,000 people and it's only been one day and I only spent five dollars within that one day so honestly I don't know what to do at this point I really 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 want to start on my Christmas candles I have an idea and all that I'm still going to work on it which I'll be doing in this vlog I want this vlog to go up on Sunday, but I don't know if I have time to finish everything today, so I might upload it on Monday because I'm off Monday. So this might go up on Monday, just a disclaimer. I usually don't post on the weekends anyways, but Sunday is like when I really work on my business stuff, like getting everything together. It's Saturday right now. Cause I had work yesterday but anyways I really want to work on my holiday candles but I have so many candles in stock right now like I have a lot and they're not selling so I don't want to make a whole bunch of holiday candles and they're just gonna be sitting on the shelf you know what I'm saying so um yeah I post every day I'm almost at 100 followers on my business page. So hopefully people will follow. I'm going to try to post. Um, I post on TikTok. Like the process of me, you know, making the candle and stuff. I post on Reels on Instagram. And wait, let me see. My Reels average about 300 views. So that's pretty good. But I think what I'm going to do is for one of my reels they upload it weird it just upload like a black screen so i think i might repost that okay so it's posted but anyways what we're going to be doing today i'm just talking about my business like what's going on i'm not selling i'm going to show you my inventory because i think i don't know if i showed you last time where i stored them but it was like this shoe thing that i had got from aldi the grocery store 
and it was like fabric and it wasn't really that stable and you know I always feared it like tipping over but this house it came with like shelves down the hallway like big shelves so like the bottom two are like reserved for me and the top of the bottom two like is full of candles like I have to stack some of them on top so yeah um because of that I haven't been able to make any more candles because I'm really just focused on selling them I want to have them all sold by the end of this month but I don't know how I'm gonna do that okay so um, this is weird look how my reels uploaded it's like a frame around it I mean it looks weird but it doesn't look bad so maybe I need to refresh it or something yeah I don't know what's going on and what I hate about reels they're not like TikTok so when you save them it's not it's not gonna um save the music so oh, I gotta get used to that but basically what we're gonna do today is we're gonna be looking I feel like my business could be so much better if I find a different job okay so what I was saying was I just posted it on TikTok it's probably not gonna do that good but oh well today I want to look at some more candle jars I have an idea for my candle jars um I really wish I could find a company that sells like those colored clear jars like I need like because I feel like when people buy candles it is for decor for decoration purposes and my my candles are just they can go with anything really but I feel like if, if it was like different colors then you know people would buy it it looks more appealing to the eye so I want to look at some more places where I can buy different jars um it's kind of hard buying jars because they're sold out all the time and it is what it is but I have this idea of jars that I want and they're yeah I might I'm just you just gonna have to see so I'm about to go somewhere and then when I come back I'm gonna film. I don't know if it's gonna be day or night. I'm hungry. I don't know if it's gonna be day or night. So when I do come back, which will only be like a second for you, you gotta go do some research, okay? On my new computer, it's really slow. I had to put an ethernet cable or something in here because it's slow, but I use my phone and it works perfectly fine. So we're gonna do that and we're going to just get some stuff. I think I might open up on Etsy. I already have an Etsy shop, but I feel like that could help me too. And we're gonna to try to set that up today too, so.
pretty much down for now. Um, it's this thing on Etsy called um, Etsy Ads, and oh my gosh, I had a Jolly Ranger, but anyways, it's this thing for Etsy Ads, and you basically spend pay like a certain amount of money a day. And I just chose five dollars, and I'm just gonna test it out for like I don't know one or two days just to see if it's efficient or not. And yeah, so I have that running. Hopefully, it could bring in some sales because I have. Ooh, I really need those. So now I'm just gonna take a break. I've um added the rest of my candles to Etsy. I really want to sell from my website, but. It's kind of hard to sell from your own website when, you know, you're just starting out and it's not that many people like searching you. But Etsy has like an inbuilt audience so people can find me within the Etsy app. So with my ads, it'll rate me higher. And I don't pay, I don't pay unless I click on the ad. So just gotta see if somebody gonna click on the ad or not but anyways um we're gonna see how that does um it's not no limit like on instagram and facebook like they have like a black like on instagram and facebook where you can like set it to end on this day like you gotta remind yourself hey I'm, i have ads running let me stop okay so I'm gonna write like a reminder on my board right now, actually. Okay, I wrote on my board and yeah, so that's really all I could do for now. I mean, I don't have any sales. I have a lot of inventory. I'm trying to get rid of some of that. Um, so yeah, I really want to make candles because I love making it. And but I ha I can't make no more. They're not selling. So yeah. So if you want to buy some of my candles, they smell really good. Like I have, I'm gonna say seven or eight scents. They're all fall inspired scents. Um pumpkin crumb cake a coffee scented candle that I named after myself um bourbon apples cinnamon vanilla which is my favorite one of my favorites mahogany teak wood which smells kind of like cologne cozy autumn nights what else roasted pumpkin spice that one smells really good um I really like that one like it doesn't smell like too pumpkin spice, but it smells like toasted. Like, it's really good. And yeah, I got like a lot. Y'all go check them out on my website. I'm gonna put it right here. My website will of course be in the description. And I'll put my Etsy shop up there too, but I really want people to go to my website. So, because Etsy like takes money out and I just want all the money because I'm spending money on my website so but Etsy has like an inbuilt audience it's just a lot um yeah so I'll come back when I'm doing something and my nose looks so shiny but yeah I'll come back when I'm doing something I'm gonna take a little break I don't know what I'm gonna do with it Okay, so I don't know about this lighting. I'm trying to use my ring light because I never use, you know what, let me turn this fan off. Oh, it's about to get so hot in here, but it is what it is. Okay, so I'm gonna try to end off everything tonight, but basically, you know how earlier I told you I ran an ad on Etsy? Well, I got an order on Etsy and I'm gonna show you how I package my orders um so yeah um this order is a little different because i've never sold anything on etsy and i'm so used to selling stuff on my site because like it goes straight to my paypal and then you know i can just transfer it to my bank account right then and there
on Etsy. I think they are going to send it to me on the 13th. Which is fair because um, when I want to get my stuff for free from my other account on my website, it takes like one or three days. So, but it usually takes up the whole three days. So, but I had this set for like one day. It's the 11th. I don't know why it's the 13th. But um, Etsy, the reason why I was so skeptical about selling on Etsy was because they take money out and I have a website. And I'm already paying for that. So they're taking like for right now. Okay, my candles are $13. And the shipping is $7. Because that's how much it costs to ship. So you're, it's just really $20 on a dot. From what I'm seeing from this transaction. Etsy took out $0.85. Cents. It took out 85 cents and a 35 cent transaction. That's like a dollar. And if I was to sell on my website, they will take about 30, 50 cents out. And then I have like $19 and 15 cents that is mine, you know? So they take out way more money. Um, I don't know. So yeah, um, we're going to fulfill that order. They, I think this person signed it as a gift. So I got to figure out how to do that because I didn't even know I had a gift um, customization. So, and they put a gift message in there. So I don't know how to, I think I just print out on paper. But yeah, I need to edit my listings because I don't know. Okay, so this person bought, I'll just tell you everything when I'm packaging everything. So yeah, I will see you. I might show you my, um, I can show you that right now. Oh, it's so heavy. So I usually had these just sitting down. They're supposed to be stored in a dark, um, cool place. It's, it's just so many smells coming out of here at once. And it's like, but anyways. This, these are all my fragrance oils for my candles. It is so heavy. I have so many. I ordered my Christmas scents already because I know when it's that time for Christmas to come, they're going to be hard to get. So I'm trying to order in advance. And I kind of stopped because um, I wasn't selling anything and I didn't want to just be buying oils and I'm not selling stuff. So, um, yeah, this is Coffee House. This is my favorite. Actually, I don't know if it's my favorite, but this is um, one of the coffee scents that I have. I will be getting another one. I just need to order the oil. I got a sample, but I need to order it. And it smells just like coffee, like it smells so good. I love coffee candles. And yeah, these are the Christmas scents that I ordered. Okay, here goes another one. And okay, these are three of the Christmas scents that I have. And I will be using different jars instead of the standard clear jar. I want them to be more prettier, you know. And I'm just trying to sell as many as I can before because I know the jars that I'm going to order are going to cost more money because they're prettier and the caps that I'm going to order I think they're going to cost more money because but it's kind of hard to get your hands on them because they're always sold out so yeah I want to order them now but I need to sell some inventory first and then I can order it so that's what I'm trying to do um I've been Every time I order from Candle Science, because that's one of the places where I get my oils, I um, always get free samples of the like Christmas scents that I want or holiday scents so I can know what to buy when it's time. So basically a lot of the Christmas scents or holiday scents have 
Oh my gosh, this smells so good. It, it, this smells just like Christmas, but this isn't from Candle Science. Oh. A lot of the Christmas fragrances or holiday fragrances, I noticed that they have like a fir tree scent. Like a, that fir tree scent, evergreen or whatever. And that's like in majority every Christmas scent is the fir evergreen scent. So this one smells so good. And so I can't wait to make my Christmas candles. I'm going to redesign my logo. I think I'm going to do like, I don't know. That's going to be the next studio vlog. Which I might start filming tomorrow after I edit this one tonight. Because I'm going to try to have this up on Monday. And yeah, so let's get to packaging this order. Okay, so this is my candle inventory on the shelves. These shelves were built into the house. So these are all my candles on the second shelf. It it goes like a long ways back here. So, and then on the bottom shelf is all my packaging supplies. I keep some, I keep some oil to clean off the candles, you know, to sanitize them because, not oil, but um, isopropyl alcohol. Will it focus? Okay, isopropyl alcohol so that I could clean off the um the work area and the candles. Um it's only 70% because it's a lot of the 90% sold out, but this is this will do anyways. But I always wipe down the candle the outside of the candles, not the inside of the candles, because you're not supposed to mix fire and um alcohol together, but I just wipe down the outside of the candle. And then um these right here this is what I wrap this is what I wrap the um candles in so they won't break during shipping process this is my packaging tape for wrapping up the packages and I'm not going to take them all out but I'm gonna zoom in you see these are what I wrap my boxes my packages in I put my candles in these um in these boxes I get them from Uline see Uline and this is where I put my candles in. And right here, I had a bigger bag. I don't know where the bigger bag is. But these are really um, packaging peanuts. And I put them in the order also so they won't break. And then these bigger boxes down here. Focus. Okay, these bigger box. I don't know. That's my dad's picture when he was with the... Um, u.s attorney i don't know but um some dude in the white house but anyways um <laughs> these boxes right here are my jars and then below are the bigger boxes in case somebody orders more than one candle and that goes my scale right there and over here is my burner where i use to melt the wax so yeah these are my candles Okay, so this is the candle that the customer wants right here. Pumpkin, pumpkin spice latte. So we're gonna go package this up. I gotta make sure. So it has like a little bit of frosting around the edges, which is normal, but it smells perfectly fine. So we're gonna use this one. Wait, let me see the other ones. I think I used this one. So we're going to go package this up.
this little mini studio vlog of basically my inventory and how I package my orders hopefully in the future when my business is like really booming and you know the holiday season is coming up so a lot of people are going to be looking for gifts so I'm excited about that hopefully I'll get more sales this one was actually a shock because as you know earlier I was literally talking about how I wasn't getting no sales so um, I'm about to relax i'm about to edit this video probably i hope you enjoyed this video please go check out my website www.briannalafay.com or you can go to my etsy shop i prefer you to go to my website because that's where all my data and analytics is even though my etsy shop is linked with my website i just prefer my website because i spend more money on my website because it's just more expensive to own than Etsy because I have to buy the domain and all that stuff. So go check out my website, www.brianlafay.com. You can buy a couple of candles, you know, support me and my small business. And yeah, I'll be trying to post some more. I'm going to actually try to post Sunday again because Sunday is like my productive day where I relax and all that good stuff. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more of these studio vlogs. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. It's on you, but I won't let it, let it, let it. The tide's rolling in, but you jump in with